So we started off uh, unboxing a uh, Alpha, and this was the original model the AMA came out with uh, several years ago. And recently they came out with a new one uh, called the Beta, which has a much, much larger box. And it's the first time I've actually seen one in person, so I'm interested to see what it looks like inside. Very interesting, much different in terms of what the packaging looks like. Um, but I have to say, there's a lot more space inside here than I thought there would be. So this is actually a much larger model, it looks like, than what the Alpha was. It has a much larger prop, thicker rubber, uh, but it appears to have the same uh, sort of 20 to 1 winder, so we'll check that out. Yeah, looks like the exact same winder. So let's go ahead and open these. We're going to have the rubber. So there's actually two different sizes of rubber. We'll put those off to the side for the moment. You have a uh, a wing doohickey. Uh, this is actually a much different uh, version than what was on the Alpha. What's interesting about this is that you can see it does curve rather than be flat like the Alpha was. And the prop is much wider and much larger. This looks to be around a seven inch prop. And yes, it looks to be a seven inch prop. Now this also looks like I'm gonna have to cut it open. Or no, it has tape. What's interesting about this particular one is that it definitely has a lot more dihedral, so a lot more. The two wingtips stick up a whole heck of a lot more than they, than they did on the Alpha. And the Beta has also has dihedral and a stabilizer, which uh, apparently clips on as well. And then the rudder, uh, it looks like it just uh, goes ahead and glues on uh, accordingly. 